All right, so I'm being nosy around the property where I'm staying and kind of helping out because it's kind of an elderly lady and she doesn't have the help that she used to. She's widowed, etc. And I'm on the property and there's like this shed that's on her property. And this shed hasn't been opened for like 20, 30 years, something like that, she said. They used to use it for gardening stuff or whatever. So I'm going to... See, here's the property, and down this walkway, I'll kind of film it. I'm curious to see what's in the shed, if there's anything reseller related, who knows? So, let's see what happens. So, here's, and of course, you know me, I'm using my, walking in my sandals. So, any snakes or anything, at least it'll be on the thing, but look at this see an old like concrete triangle table I bet you that has value since it's concrete that holds up to the weather she could sell that here's an old bench there's that if that's cast iron the edges look pretty good and oh man there's a padlock look at that the flowers are blooming out of it um, let's see anything. I don't know if I can get in here. It looks like it's got a padlock on it. Bummer. Let's see if there's anything on the side. Wow, you can tell it's just been so long since anybody's been back here. Oh, uh, hopefully right now. Poison ivy. Looks like there's something that lives underneath there. I don't even know if she has her key. Let's go to that. Hmm. I don't see anything. No thorns. I'm trying to see if there's anything back here. I feel like I'm off-roading or something. And there's something else that probably lives underneath that. Freaking the skunk or something comes and gets me and I have to take a ketchup bath or something. That would be ridiculous. Here's the other side of it. I'm not seeing any entryway or nothing. Man, you can tell it's been a long time since someone's been back here. There's a lizard that's like stuck inside there. I don't even know how it that gets out. Wow. Man, you see anything in there? Any tools? There's gas tanks. There's stuff in there though. I'd like to get in there and see if there's anything really reseller related. Alright. So I'm gonna have to find out if she has the key to this lock because I can't get in there to check it out unless she does. So let's see what happens. There's another bolo item I just ran across. You ever see video VHS and DVD recorders in the wild? This one happens to be, yeah, let's say 50 to $75. I'll drop the pump. All right, so she had to dig around in her junk drawer, but there's the keys. She said these are them. And I asked her flat out, when was the last time she was back here in this shed? And I didn't want to push her buttons a little bit because she's, you know, a widow and et cetera. But she couldn't tell me. I was like, guess, I said, give me a guesstimate. Five years, 10 years? And she just rolled her eyes. So she's under the impression that there's nothing back here that's worth any value. But then she also doesn't know things that are worth value. Like I tried to tell her, this is like a retro, modern, like outdoor table. And it, it holds up to the weather perfectly. It's, I mean, all I gotta do is brush it off. And I bet you I can post that locally on Facebook Marketplace or off up. And I don't know, it's pretty large. I wanna say it's like six or seven foot modern triangle with a base. 
I'm gonna try it for a couple hundred dollars and see what happens. Um, I'm not really seeing any. I mean, look at this. I don't even know how I'm gonna open the door, guys. All right, bear with me. Let's see if the key even works. Wow. Look at this thing. Moment of truth. Here we go. Oh, it's going in. Oh no. I'm turning it. Oh. We're in action. Alright, y'all put in the comment section, am I gonna find anything of value to resell? Let's see here. Or do you think I'm gonna have like some animal run out on me? stuff in here guys let's find out I don't see any rats running around I don't see anything running around at me if something jumps out this video better go viral all right don't see anything yet bunch of gardening stuff all right, I'm gonna have to turn on the flash let me see I'm gonna have to cut the video and then start video recording with a flash. So bear with me. Okay. I've got the flash on. Let's see what's in this shed. Of value. Old shed in the woods. Okay. First thing I'm looking for would be like rat poison. People don't know. That that's worth money. God, look at all this stuff. A lot of, a lot of gardening stuff. If there's any um, rat killer, I'll put sc uh, screenshots of the values on that. A lot of people don't know. Right, so far, a lot of gardening stuff, and that's not. Sometimes these old rulers. Depending on what it's from. Carolina Sofa Company. No. What's this one? Um, another discount carpet. Nothing. Okay, let's keep going. If y'all see something of value, y'all let me know. Um, this old chair ain't worth anything, but if you happen to see the old tube vinyl tube chairs that are trifold, those are worth money. Um, what's this? Royal Basmati Rice. Not sure on that one. Rope always has the value for somebody. Uh, what's in the box? Y'all know what reference I'm doing on that one, right? If you don't, I'll give you a hint. First hint would be a Brad Pitt and Morgan Freeman movie. Still don't get it? Let me know if you need a hint. What's in the box? All right, a lot of just tools. I was hoping to find some like hat, like old hats, like John Deere or Cat or anything like that hanging up in the rafters. People don't realize that those are worth some money. Old shirts and stuff like that. But not so much. Hmm. Oh, just old, a lot of gardening stuff. A lot of gardening stuff. Nothing back here. I don't know what's in this box. Nothing up in the rafters. What's in this bag? Nothing in the bag. Tools, gardening. Hmm. She's got a lot of money that she spent on all these chemicals, I'll tell you that. Alright, I'm gonna see what's in this box real quick, guys. 
just because I know y'all are curious just like me, right? I'm gonna have to take this molding that's kind of draped up here and move it so I can get to that box. So bear with me, I might have to cut the video for a second. All right, I got the box down. Looks like a bunch of felt, packing paper felt, old sheets, old sheets, old sheets. A lot of old sheets and packing. Old blankets. Nothing of consequence, guys. That was up here. I don't know why she put old sheets, but maybe she was wrapping her old plants. If there was a freeze or something, that's what she wrapped her plants with. That could be the guess. There's an old sledgehammer. There's some value. Blades. Well, we gave it a shot, guys. Wishful thinking would have been a, if there was a double claw head hammer. If you ever seen that, I'll put a screenshot. But if you ever see a double claw hammer at an old tool estate sale, those have some value. All right, well, at least we satisfied our curiosity. Really didn't find anything worth value for reselling goes. But at least it made for a video, made for some fun, just in case something in here happened or what have you. I don't think, should I trust? That's it guys so if y'all like this video and you want to possibly watch for more content on items you might find that are worth money that you didn't know about feel free to subscribe to the channel i do share a lot of information so you can make money on the side or make it a permanent source of income take care guys thanks for watching bye So this is good.